for Nick Cushing's side from the team that played last against Philadelphia Union, Tayesh Magno, coming into that forward line, Dan. Young Jorge Guzman, just 19 years of age, as well as the new signing, Jordi Caicedo, who joins from Tigres. And that's because of these moments, because of exactly what you just said, the amount of games that they have yet to win because of the production. Santi Rodriguez will control ahead of the corner flag. Parks on for Magno, who can still control Tyus Magno. Lovely feet, Tyus Magno tried to bend it into that corner with the clearance off the line. And a massive intervention there from Santa Maria. The ball is still on. Well, you see Santi Rodriguez already out in that wide space, but Eden Parks does a really nice job in finding Magno, but then Magno's feet, excellent. Beats Vargas, but Santa Maria, you see he's in, out, through, takes his opportunity. Will be a corner. Usman over it. Let's have the option short. We'll lay it off there. Lofts it into the area. Measuring the volley and taking and scoring. What a hit there from Aldo Rocha. The late arriver into the penalty area and hits the volley to perfection. And Atlas have a lead here at City Field. We've seen some schoolyard plays from Atlas already in their early Apertura games, and Roca has been the recipient of one of them early against Cruz Azul, but tonight he does, you can see the back door wide open. The technical execution of that floated ball all the way through the box, and he's on the end of it, goes near post. What a finish, and what a start for Atlas. Bring that strong mentality into that Back line, Parks on the turn. Parks trying to charge through that middle, a strong sliding challenge coming through, and it's gonna be a free kick. Wow. Santa Maria got a piece there of Parks and earns the yellow card to boot. A counter could be on here, controlling neatly. Aguirre and Caicedo, Aguirre now on the near side. Oking Pian initially, Chano the arm up, and the free kick will be given in a dangerous crossing position how important it is just to extend some of these plays out just a little bit longer. Rodriguez now whipping it in. The header came on there, and it lands on the roof of the net for Martins. Martins cutting inside. Martins into Kufre on for Tyus Magno! Oh! Skims the outside of the post. Last 10, 12 minutes have been good for NYCFC, but look at this interchange, how quickly it happens. And Magno just kisses the post. A lovely touch across his body and then comes back the opposite direction. Has Vargas beat with the left foot. You see the outstretched arms of Camilo Vargas can only watch. As we're underway with the second 45 minutes, NYCFC trying to claw it back here against an Aklas team that were pretty solid. Corner taken short, lofted in by Reyes. The header comes in and Barraza having to get down to his left and on the second time grabbed the head of Caicedo who's trying to take advantage of any spillage. Ilinich, 18 year old on signing was described by David Lee, the sporting director, as one of the most sought after young talents in Europe. And I'm here to New York City as it's in behind into Caicedo. His first time strike. Straight forward there for Barraza. Here's Reyes' ball. In towards the near post. Head around from Aguirre. And Barraza never really looked that troubled as he just watched it go wide. And Pellegrini moving out to the right wing here is eventually a yellow card coming out here for. Jaciel Martinez. NYCFC wanted to take the free kick quickly. For to center for delaying the restart. Abi Kufre, who will strike over the wall and over the bar. Saw a similar effort from Rodriguez in the first half and just unable to hit target from that sort of range. Out wide for Gray, it's a fantastic ball. Tavon Gray just trying to squeeze it through that six yard area, and it was nearly a debut goal for Bacroar, if not for the save of Camilo Vargas. Forward, but this is a lovely ball, lovely touch, and look at that little slot. Bacroar just off the back shoulder. 
of Hugo Nervo. Lovely cross. And just enough. Another chance of that sort of quality. Surge of noise to the ground. Rodriguez again coming forward. Again has won a foul. And another yellow card handed out. Desma to swing it in towards the back post. Parks was there. It's away from Abella. NYCFC trying to keep in the danger. Justin Hack has drawn NYCFC level. Impact substitute. New York City level. And for NYCFC, dangerous ball in from Richie Ledesma. Santi Rodriguez keeps it in play. The physicality. We'll have a healthy amount of second half stoppage time and now after video review the goal is disallowed offside even against Justin Hack and it's back to 1-0 in favor of Atlas with only second half stoppage time left to play and now NYCFC will have to go again as now it could be a chance on here for Rodriguez is in behind Rodriguez right at Vargas who's into the save Offside flag eventually coming up. Now Caicedo potentially put the finishing touch on this one. Caicedo trying to cut inside. Caicedo leaving it for the first time. Strike. It takes an deflection and goes wide there. Gray. Taken down there by Young Guzman who's going to go to full nine. He's the strike coming in from a long way out. Dealt with there. The referee, the referee who whistled to lips, and there it goes, full time at City Field. Atlas have come to New York City and beaten 